and now I'm going to show you another exercise which is fantastic for shoulder stretch. It's very very effective and in this exercise we use a wall as a prop, the wall which is behind us. Uh, now because I have immediate, immediately here I have a window, I at the moment had to move my piano chair. But for those of you who have a wall and who don't want to do any standing exercises, this is a fantastic exercise. It's also great for all the sound mixers, sound engineers, because that would provide stretch. It's a lazy stretch, especially if you don't want to get up. The only thing, make sure that you're sitting on something and you don't have your back supported, because we will be reaching backwards. So we start with piano yoga sitting position, we lift the toes as wide as possible, spread them, put them down wide by one. Then we lift our heels as high as possible and put them down. That connects us to the floor, engages our inner legs, engages our abdominals. We lift shoulders and drop, bring shoulders back and down, lengthen through your fingertips. Imagine someone pulling them down, open your palms, spread the fingers and then turn so they're facing a piano or if you're a sound engineer, you can be uh, facing your desk. And that's your initial position. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to turn to face the camera, put my hand slightly, roughly on the level of my uh, shoulder, starting with a bent uh, elbow, so very gently, and then very gently I'm going to start it with my feet, I'm going to start moving my feet and then, be forward in, uh, then following the feet I'm going to move my trunk, oh I love this stretch, and then when I can't move any further I'm going to look in the opposite direction. This is very very strong stretch, some people like to put hand a little bit down but ideally you want to have it on the level of your shoulder which of course you need to find out and decide what is comfortable and uh, because this is a very long, strong stretch you just hold it to start with between 5 to 10 seconds and then you can increase if you wish and then to come out you slowly turn back bend your elbow and only then to come out so please don't come out just when you're in that position because it's quite uh, I think it's unhealthy now we're going to do it on another side, so I'm going to turn with my back to you, please forgive me. So again, find a place on the level of your shoulder and then slowly, slowly, slowly start turning. Now you may find that you feel different on different sides. For me this is much deeper stretch, it goes much more deep. Um, it feels like a very heavy massage, very deep and it feels fantastic. Couple of more breath and then I'm gonna come back, turn to the wall, come and face you. Now you're supposed to do this, I'm inviting you to do it, if you're lazy you don't want to get up and do yogic exercises which I will later demonstrate but this, assuming you do this exercise, assuming you are warm, you've been working, you are tired. If you feel cold and not flexible, I won't recommend you to go straight for this exercise. Or what you could do, you can just again lift your hands, look up, fingertips touching, and bring it down. Another version, fingers in touching, elbow wide, that's another one, but this is a bit more advanced, oops, and bring it down. So to do anything to warm up your hands. And again you do little shoulder roll and off you go.